Swiggity swag, what's in the bag? Jay here, bringing you guys some more Boku no Hero Academia Smash Tap here on the channel. And today, we're going to be jumping into a brand new event in the game. Well, it's not really a brand new event. It's honestly an old event that has been reskinned and uh, whatnot. And that is the Culture Festival, which essentially is the Battle Royale, you guys. Like, literally, if we go over here into the menu and uh, go to Event, as you guys can see, it says My Hero Royale. It's literally the 1v1 the pvp event that they had several times in the game and honestly i love this event i love it because it's battle royale i love the battle royale event i love the my hero royale uh the 1v1 the pvp event because you can do it infinitely essentially you don't need stamina or anything like that and you can do it infinitely and i really 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 enjoy the fact that you don't need stamina for this event and whatnot but of course with this event we have a new banner as well if we go over here to the uh banner as you guys can see is a step up banner so you uh you can use 10 stones for a three multi summon and then you can use 30 stones then you can use i think 50 and then 50 and then another 50 which i mean i guess step up banners are okay but i guess for me personally i don't like them because you need a certain amount of stones in order to guarantee yourself a character like in this one right here you need 50 50 100 150 uh you need about 190 stones close to 200 stones or hero souls uh in this game you need two close to 200 to guarantee yourself one of these units and you might not even get the one that you want you know i mean you might get the one that you want even before you reach that step five but personally i don't really too much care about the step up banners but i will go through what units you can get from uh or what i guess what exclusive units you can get from this banner and from the event but i hope you guys do enjoy this video if you guys do hit that like button down below to show you support if you need any kind of smash tab help check out the reddit check out the discord in the video description below leave a comment down below as well have you guys been grinding out uh this event i've been grinding out this event on two accounts uh as you guys can probably tell this is not my main account this is my secondary account because this is the account where i re-rolled for the dual todoroki and honestly i've been having a lot easier time with this account than my main account and that's only because my main account doesn't have a stupidly busted crazy broken uh, smash fest unit i mean it has a smash fest unit in terms of you know grant serino but grant serino on the tier list is not really i mean he's good but he's not ss rank so like they, I, I don't know it's, it's, it's really hard running through with a blue unit that's not even all that good anyway because full cowling deku is running around in this event and it's, it's terrifying but speaking of deku uh if you do this event you know there is a battle royale uh exclusive character that you can grind up to 99 i'm gonna to go ahead and show you guys that character right now and that is this deku right here so as you guys can see this is skinned after the ending two of season two of my hero academia so if you guys remember like bakugo was on a dragon and stuff and everybody has like a sword and stuff and they're knights and everything and that that's essentially uh what this is skinned after and i mean i, I guess it's okay i mean honestly it feels like they're trying to milk the game a little bit they're trying to milk it before season three and i guess they got to pull out all the stops so i mean i i i'll take it you know it's a it's essentially a free deku and a free 99 unit i'll take it why not i need more 99 units especially in this game right here because i don't really have many units here but as you guys can see i do have this uh todoroki so uh we're looking pretty okay i need to ultra awaken them but i need dupes for that but anyways what we're gonna do is we're gonna we're going to awaken this deku right here so i can go ahead and show you guys uh you know what he does and everything but uh if we're gonna look at what he does so his special is grand smash swinging his sword with a great slash dealing huge damage and increasing attack for 10 seconds his passive hp increased by uh seven percent 15 percent extra damage towards red types so that's actually really it's actually really good it's actually really nice um i tried using him in the uh event and it, it wasn't working it it was not working like i said blue units in this event like unless they are stupidly broken you're, you're not getting getting far if you because if you run into a full cowling deku it's pretty much a wrap okay he literally one shots a, a lot of stuff in the game and it's just, it's just ridiculous but what we're gonna do is we're gonna level him up to level 70 uh maximum level so that we can awaken him and then i'm gonna go over the other units that you can get from this little event as well you guys so 
So our Deku is now max level. Let's go ahead and let's awaken him and I'll show you now. I don't like this art. I'm just gonna be real. I don't like this art. I really don't like this art for Deku. I really don't like it. Does, it feels like it doesn't fit in the game. You know, it just doesn't. It feels like it doesn't fit. Like, 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 like look, 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 look. When you take a look at it, it just feels like it doesn't fit in the game. Like. I feel like they should have at least zoomed in on his face a little bit more for his for his little screenshot here, but they didn't. So it just feels really out of place to me. I don't know. It, it just feels really out of place. But as you guys can also see on the banner, you can get a Todoroki, you can get an Ida, and you can get a Momo. So let's go ahead and go over what they do. So Momo, I've actually I saw somebody's Momo and they had like 13k attack on their momo that's because they get a boost from this event but uh momo her special attack goes up for 10 seconds deals high damage with the last blow and her passive hp attack plus seven percent and then we have todoroki um his special is print strike freezes the enemy in front of him and slashes towards them dealing huge damage with the last hit inflicts speed down for 10 seconds to enemies hit his passive defense increased by 15 percent and is immune to defense down and then if we go take a look at ida a uh, special revolving slash damage with continuous rotation slash uh, speed up for 10 seconds and then his passive defense increased by 7% and damage from speed attribute is reduced by 10% so these units are I mean they're all right um, I mean if I wanted any any of them it'll probably be Momo just because I don't have like a super duper good Momo unit I don't know if she's super duper good she's she's all right in this event but purple five star Deku apparently wrecks her uh, so there's that but also there's a gadget banner and you do get a boost if you, you get a boost in points if you use their gadgets so I spent a lot of time explaining this whole event to you guys and oh yeah also you can get gotcha tickets from this event and do summon I'll probably do a couple summons for you guys in this video and you know get shafted like I do in every um, in every game but essentially it is battle royale so if you guys know what battle royale is when it comes to smash tap then you already know uh how this works so essentially what you do you can either use one ticket to battle or you use three tickets to battle if you use three tickets to battle you get more points uh towards your total and there is a ranking system as well and uh there's like daily ranking and stuff like that and uh according to where you rank at uh daily you get some rewards and stuff so uh, right now I am where am I at oh I'm not even I haven't even ranked yet uh, because I haven't done this today I've done it on my main account but not this not this account but essentially yeah it's just 1v1 so uh, it's just 1v1 so we're gonna use one ticket and we're just gonna kind of run through and do whatever as you guys can see I'm using the Eda helmet so I get a boost in points um, for every uh, every streak of five that you hit, you get a Deku. Uh, you get a Deku, and then for every ten streak you hit, uh, you get more points because it's the extra stage that you uh, you get. So, so that's essentially it. So every so you know, hit a streak of five, you get a Deku. Hit a uh, hit a streak of ten. Uh, I mean, you'll get a Deku obviously because that goes into the streak of five, and then at the same time after that there'll be an extra stage where you get uh, more points than usual so I'll show you guys right here honestly I mean I could literally fly through this event like totally like I said Todoroki like this Todoroki he's good he's nice in this event he freezes and then burns but the only issue I run into is full cowling Deku that is the only issue I run into and th and that's when you get like up higher too. like this Deku here I mean he he's not he's not really much of anything I mean like he does massive damage yeah but he's not he's not a full cow he's not a full cowling you know full cowling we're weak to we're, we're weak to green units as well which makes it a lot worse so so yeah but yeah it's essentially battle royale and I like it I love this event I love this event because you can continuously grind forever essentially like you know you can just grind forever and that's just it you don't have to use Taiyaki to get your stamina back you don't have to use hero souls to get your stamina back you don't have to do any of that because you don't use any stamina at all 
and not only that but if your account is low leveled as well this is also a really good way to level up your account like i was i rank i went up like a couple um a couple ranks so i went up a couple ranks and oh snap whoa i need you to not do that buddy <laughs> i'm gonna need you to not do that whoa but um but yeah like i said though the only uh, the only issue i run into is full cowling deku okay because that deku can essentially body me he can essentially body me and it's 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 terrifying it is absolutely terrifying just how much damage he can do he can do like 13k damage to me and i, I mean i'm a blue unit so i'm taking more damage from him so so yeah also uh, i think every three matches uh starting from one uh or starting from your first uh streak or whatever you get uh a little gold ticket which can be used to replenish your rp here or bp not, not rp your bp and you know you can continue to go so like i said it's an endless event it's endless up oh, and speaking of full cowling there he is oh boy let's see let's see what happens you guys i'm actually really afraid i mean i don't think we'll lose to this one mainly because it's pretty early in the streak but if we up oh, see nope this is the problem this is the problem this is the problem this is the problem okay oh he ran into it <laughs> oh bless dude he ran into it he ran into it thank goodness see if you can't one shot and if you miss your if you miss your freeze you're done for oh there we go we got a deku because we hit a streak of 25 which is a streak of five so there we go we hit a streak of five and if you hit a streak of 10 then you get an extra you get an extra stage so that's essentially uh that's essentially the event like it's not it's not a bad event it's not, it's a really good event it's really good um you know it gets me playing the game again i mean i've been playing the game for a minute and you know i also grinded up on this account for present mike so i grinded up present mike twice and now i'm about to uh, grind up deku twice and i'm hoping i can get to 99 deku i mean i was able to grind out 20 in a day and this event lasts i'm pretty sure it lasts for about a week i'm not sure it might last actually it might last longer than a week because there are this isn't the this is only act one of the event as well so there's another one another culture festival coming afterwards which obviously that's going to give us the bakugo the ochako and um the kirishima as you guys can see up here in a little banner um that's going to give us those characters now am i going to actually summon on the step up banner for them no honestly any stones on this second account is going to be saved for a smash fest uh, so i can have another good smash fest unit and then that way this account will be pretty much set and then it'll probably be better than my main account my main account has a lot of 99 units and stuff has a lot of old school units but in terms of is it good is it better than this account i i don't know like i i don't know like this this account this second account i'm running on right now it's it's really nice like i'm glad i re-rolled i didn't have to re-roll that many times either so i don't know but hey banner rates are still complete total garbage in this game and i don't think uh i don't think they're going to fix it anytime soon so so it is a rip okay i'm gonna do one more and then what's gonna happen is we're gonna go to the banner and we're gonna use our gotcha tickets and we're gonna summon for something oh look at that how about that we're fighting we're fighting ourselves and it's so crazy because i actually fight people's characters from the discord and it's terrifying because some of these people's characters are crazy strong and broken and ridiculous you think this dude here is broken that i'm using like no like if i had the proper gadgets i yo if i had the proper gadgets on him he could probably have like 13 14k attack or something like that 12k 13k attack and literally literally one shot everything in the game like literally it's terrifying it is terrifying but let's go ahead and do a gadget not gadget let's do a summon here you guys so we're gonna do three singles and a multi and we're gonna see what we get with these gotcha tickets you guys so we're gonna we're gonna get shafted we're gonna get shafted okay it says new because obviously i don't have i haven't gotten all these units yet so okay uh um that's that's all right whatever 
I mean, hopefully, hopefully we can get some sort of five star. Like, if we can get like a cheerleader five star, that'd be lit. You know, if we can get like Momo or Ochako, that will be amazing. Should I do a multi? Nah, I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do ten singles. I'm gonna do ten singles. I don't know. I like. I feel like singles are just okay. So we got Bakugo. What? Oh come on, dog! You can't show me Bakugo animation and give me a three star. That's booty. That is booty. Okay. It's not even a good dinky. <laughs> He ain't even all that great, man. You keep showing me Bakugo animation, but like, come on, what we doing? Another Bakugo animation. Mm, not even the six star Mineta? Man, I tell you, rates in this game are bad. But it's crazy though, because in my on my main account, like I had Bakugo animation, got a five star. Ended up being red Bakugo, so I'm just like, okay, well maybe if I get yellow Bakugo on that account, then I can, I can uh, ultra awaken. But you know, whatever. But still, but man, Smash Tap really needs to like their rates are just wow. You know, like wow. Like if you want to get shafted in a gotcha game, play this game. I'm telling you, play this game. You will get shafted, guaranteed. Like, it's a guarantee that you will get shafted unless you wail on this game. But, you know, I feel like wailing on this game is dangerous. Oh, look, the new Coda. Um, wailing on this game is dangerous, though, because, like I said, the rates are bad. That's why, honestly, like, if you plan on starting Smash Tap, start Smash Tap during Smash Fest. They give you a free, uh, they give you a free 50 uh, for a multi and a couple for some singles. Um, when you start the game, like do that and re-roll. Dang. Wow. Booty butt cheek units. Well, I'm not say all of them are booty butt cheeks, but like, ah, they could be better. They could, I mean like, ah, uh, mm, mm, they could be better. I mean, we got Coda, but I mean, I don't really too much care about Coda like that to be completely and totally honest with you. So, wow, gotcha tickets. But I mean, hey, you know, we didn't use any of our uh, hero souls, so that's really good. I do need to do some summons for gadgets, but I'll I'll wait for that honestly. But but yeah, but yeah, wait. How long is this banner up for? Until the twelfth? When is that? Is that next week? That is definitely not next week. So this event actually lasts. This uh, this banner lasts what two weeks? Yeah, that banner lasts a whole two weeks. Jeez, and this lasts two weeks too. Dang. Okay, that's nice. So they give us they give us plenty of time. So I'm guessing that uh, I'm guessing that this Deku here. Hang on, let me look. Yeah, this lasts two weeks. Never mind, it doesn't last a week. Hello. Why am I rushing then? I don't know why I was trying to rush and get through with this, bro. It lasts a whole two weeks. <laughs> It lasts a whole two weeks, you guys. So, yeah, because today I'm recording this, it is the 29th, and this will be going up on Thursday. So, from the Tuesday, which is the 28th, the 5th, 12th, but yeah, it lasts a, like, a nice, actually, yeah, two weeks. So, so yeah, you are fine. We're fine. We are fine, you guys. But anyways, that's going to go ahead and do it for the video, you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys did, Hit the like button down below to show your support. Let me know in the comment section below if you guys are doing this event. Are you guys grinding out this uh, Deku to 99? Do you guys think this Deku is good or nah? Uh, how are you doing in the event? And uh, yeah, do you like it? I love this event. I love Battle Royale because again, you can do it infinitely. It doesn't spend any of your uh, stamina. And I like that. I like events that don't use your stamina. It's, it's great. It is great. Oh look, we get another five gotcha tickets. That is crazy. We could do a whole we could do a whole nother summon. So I'll probably do that summon off screen and hopefully maybe get something good. I don't know. We'll see what happens. But thank you guys so much for watching. Check out the video description below for the Smash Tap Discord and the Reddit if you need any help with the game. But I'm gonna go ahead and get out of here. Thank you guys for watching, and I will see you guys next time. Consider hitting the subscribe button down below if you're new around here and you enjoy what you see, and ring the little bell so you'll be notified when I do upload here on YouTube. Okay, now I'm out of here. Peace.